The BlueWorks Live Glossary allows you to manage the property values that users enter as they document processes in your BlueWorks Live account. The glossary provides an effective way to manage all of the values that are used across an account to help encourage best practices and standardize on terminology. To manage the glossary, you must have permission to edit and manage the glossary. To access the glossary, go to the Library section of BlueWorks Live and click on the Glossary tab. From here, you can select which properties you want to view across your account, as well as manage the values for those properties. In the Glossary, you can expand a section to see all of the values for a specific property. Users only see an Edit Values from spaces they have access to. In the Glossary, you can add descriptions, mark values as preferred, rename and merge existing values. It's a good idea to use the Where Use feature before making any changes in the Glossary to determine the impact the changes will have across your account. Glossary permissions are managed in the Users section of the Glossary. Glossary permissions allow you to control who has access to and who can manage the BlueWorks Live Glossary. You can see the list of Glossary participants and which users have permission to edit and manage the Glossary. In addition to managing the Glossary, Glossary managers can manage Glossary permissions and can designate other users as Glossary managers. By default, all admins can manage the Glossary. To add a Glossary participant, click the Add button, select the user from the list, and click the plus sign next to the user's name. To manage Glossary management permissions, click the Manage and Edit Glossary checkbox. Let's see how a Glossary Manager can designate values as preferred values. For a given property, preferred values are those that represent standard terms within your account. To set a value as a preferred value, simply check the preferred box next to the value. It's a good idea to provide a meaningful description for preferred values to help users recognize and understand the values so they can easily use them when blueprinting processes. Renaming a value is as simple as selecting a value and typing in the new name. Any process that displayed the old value now displays the new one. To merge values, select all the values you wish to merge and check the Merge checkbox. Once you have selected the values to be merged, click the Merge Values button. A new pop-up will open allowing you to decide which value will be used to replace the other values. You can merge standard values into preferred values, but not vice versa. You can also see how many processes will be affected by the merge at the bottom of this dialog. Remember, you can only select values from the same category to be merged. We hope this short video helped you understand how the BlueWorks Live Glossary can help you achieve deeper understanding and greater consistency in your process blueprints. If you have any questions, contact us at support at blueworkslive.com.